Hey guys, welcome back to another Young Chaos Game. It's April 12th, 2024, and we're checking the Ironshock Alpha J. So, of course, today was kind of the official start to the Element, um, uh, aka the Avatar collab, which does include a lot of new items. There's a whole mini battle pass like we have seen in the past, like Star Wars, for example, or Jujutsu Kaisen a few seasons ago. But anyways, with this one, we do have a ton of rewards. We have, like, the spray over here. We guess can I guess I could go over all of them. So, on the free side, you can get these from just completing the quest completely for free really really nice that we have these so we had the uh, the spray right here with this is the elemental cycle the four element banner which is a really cool free reward we also have the level up pretty much just a level up for your battle pass four elements i love this loan screen it's a great one level up another just level up for your battle pass uh dry me a uh, dry rim i'm dry in i'm definitely pronouncing that one incorrectly but it does have a bunch of different color variants which is super super cool and for a guitar which is for free love that we also do have another level up my cabbage i love this emote and i believe this one is this the final no this is not the final reward so for free you're definitely getting i guess not really your money's worth because it's absolutely for free i love this one and we also have laughing top pretty cool among the puns animated as well and we also have another level up once again and for the final item it's ahsoka's a space a sword it's a pretty cool one and the horse and one does have that cell shading not a bad final reward and then the paid section this is if you pay a thousand V-Bucks, you get the following so we have baffled ink this is um an, uh, what is this an animated mode con sorry and we also do have a banner icon, a level up, Aang's Air Spirit Emo, which is a pretty cool traversal emo, love that. Level up as well, Momo's a messenger, I love this baffling, such a nice one. And it is reactive to your gameplay, awesome. We also do have a level up, Avatar Aang, pretty cool um, spray right there. The Air no uh, Nomad, Nomad Staff, a pretty cool art until we have some very similar ones, but it's not bad. Another level up and Avatar State Aang. This is, of course, th the main attraction to the page section. This is, of course, going off of the Avatar Aang uh, skin that we already have when purchasing this pass. So pretty cool there. And then on top of that, we do uh, can unlock the pop up divider, which is a really, really nice free reward. Love this one. Probably my personal favorite free reward. Super great one. And you get these by collecting all six uh, chakras or chakras. Definitely mispronouncing that one, but a very awesome collab. And of course, we do have all the different elemental bendings in the game already. Awesome there. We're going to the actual item shop today. I'm not seeing anything new, so let's just dive right into it. We swamp soccer, we're training without being swampy sack. A Ralph at 12 new V-Bucks. The skin includes a certain dark swamp variant. It's a pretty cool one, and it does include that new detailed Lego variant. It does look pretty weird. And we Scarlet at Defend, we're training, and they come off in V-Bucks with a certain no hat variant. And a detailed Lego style. We saw again and then come out for 800 V Bucks, also with that Spring Bloom variant and a detailed Lego style in the most recent update. Love this one. We also have Tangerine Terror 500 V Bucks with that secondary Spring Bloom variant, a very nice secondary style. And we also have a trend that setter, I think I'm baffling, 200 V-Bucks. This one also includes that secondary variant. We swamp slicer, a rehearsal tool, 800 V-Bucks, also with that secondary swamp stalker variant. Fuel, and then coming up, 200 V-Bucks. We also have snow patroller with the mapping uh, Cairo chamber. This is a rehearsal at 1200 V-Bucks, also with that detail logo style. Looks pretty weird, definitely that mask doesn't fit it too well. But it's not a bad one. New Arctica with the backing Modern Summit, a Ralph at 1200 V-Bucks. The skin also includes that detail logo style. Not bad there. Choke out and then come out for 800 V-Bucks, also that Lego variant. Scrap Knight Jewels with the backing Elm's Mantle, a Ralph at 1200 V-Bucks. Love this outfit. And in the most recent update, they did get that Lego variant, which looks so sick. I love the way this one turned out. We Pink Axe, a Ralph's, an Uncommon Ralph's until uh, 500 V-Bucks. And the Winx Spammer, this is an uh, Ralph's until 800 V-Bucks. Odyssey returning an epic outfit, 1500 V-Bucks, a really great outfit, however it had so much potential that it definitely did lose, and this was originally what we all thought going to be a rank skin that we can unlock in the cups, but obviously that isn't the case as it's an eye drop skin, and this will forever stay the rank that you received this season. So for me right now, it's Elite about to be champion, so if I just quit right now, I'll have Elite forever, so if this is my personal favorite variant, I guess I purchase it and keep Elite, and yeah, his it's definitely not the best system that they got going, but it does include a pretty cool secondary helmet variant and a detailed logo style, which looks very awesome. We Blade of Ages, uh, Rare Harvesting Tool, 800 V-Bucks, and I believe this one also is reactive to your current rank, so pretty cool there. We Doggo with the map and Chow Down, and Epic Outfit, 1500 V-Bucks, does include four different variants, so pretty cool there. And doesn't include a Lego variant, which is very, very surprising. I would have thought this one would have had one. Anyways, we have Sandstorm, a Ralph at 1200 V-Bucks, also that detailed Lego style, and three different styles. 
pretty cool there. We have Kira with a Mavic Impact Ring, a Rafa 12 Jubilee Bucks, also that detailed Lego variant, and does include that secondary love lighter variant for the skin and battling. We have Ava returning with the Mapping Tars Heart, an epic outfit, 1500 V-Bucks. This skin has a lot going for it. We have the Force of Default style, a reactivity, and a secondary Tar variant. There also is an epic villain ready up emo, which transforms you into that default style into that Tar one. And on top of that, the skin did receive a detailed Lego style, which is really, really nice. I love this one. And the Tars Heart Bapling is also reactive to Elimination. Such a great outfit right there. We surf Rider with the Bapling Shortwave, a Ralph at 12 new V-Bucks. The Order with the Bapling, the Order Wingspan, a Ralph at 12 new V-Bucks. The skin does include that certain helmet variant. And if you do decide to keep that helmet on, you can select four different visors on top of that. Very awesome. We also do have Dark Search there, also the Bapling Dark Hatchling. Uh, Dark Series outfit, 12 new V-Bucks, also that secondary purple variant, same thing for the battling as well, and a detailed Lego style, which I think they aced this one, looks super good. And we buy Mark, and Upper Horse until 12 new V-Bucks, and Pterodactyl, and then buy 12 new V-Bucks. Now that seems to be it for today's soul, pretty big iron shop, hope you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe if you are new, give us a like, and hit that bell, bye!